Hi, this is Wes Fryer at ICE 2015 with Kyle Calderwood. Uh, the teach meet has just been completed and I'm eager to not only hear how it goes, but also a little bit about how the teach meets are different from ed camps. How you doing? Uh, teach meets are a little different than ed camps where there's two major differences. One, our schedule is predetermined and the other is our sessions are 20 minutes. Now, those sessions in the U.S. are 20 minutes. In the U.K. and Australia, they're two and seven minutes. So when you tell a teacher, hey, we're going to do a two and a seven minute session when they're used to the hour, it's pretty daunting. They don't know how they're going to get through it. Um, so we kind of scaled it up just a touch to about 20 minutes. And it's, uh, other than that, it's the only major difference. We both believe in the same philosophies that it's for teachers by teachers. There's no uh, sponsors that are presenting there trying to sell you something. It's all just teachers sharing best practices and what they do in their classroom. And if you don't like a session, hey, get up, walk up, go to the next session. It's your time, you use it. A lot of times you'll have more than one room, is that true? Yes. So today was a little different? Yeah, today was a little different. We had one room um, and we just kept going all day and it actually, I was a little worried at first, but it, it came out beautifully. Um, at mine in Teach Me New Jersey, we have about seven rooms, seven, eight rooms, two computer labs and then lecture space. So we kind of spread it out, but uh, here it was, it, was, it was great. And can you tell us your history of Teach Meets? Like when was your first one and how did, how did you come to today with Teach Meet? Sure, I actually met Will King. He runs Teach Meet Kentucky. I met him in 2011 at the ISTE here in uh, Pennsylvania. And uh, we started talking, he told me about Teach Meets. It sounded interesting. So the following year in 2012, I helped start Teach Meet New Jersey. Um, and then from there, we kind of collaborated. I've gone down to his and presented. He's come up to mine, and we work together. And it's been it's been a great experience. So, how would you um, recommend people think about Ed Camp versus Teach Meet if they want to bring something like this to their school? Like, how would you decide? Yeah, I, I think it all depends on the format that you prefer as an educator. Are you do you like to get that expanded one hour session, or you kind of just want that bite to whet your appetite? Okay, this is something I want to learn more about, but perhaps later. Um, so it's, it's really how you want to do it, but I think both philosophies are easy to replicate within a district, a wing of your teachers, however small you want to start or how large you want to do it. We're, you know, we cover four states, but you, know, you can do it as small as you want and it's free. Well, I'm now with Ben Hartman from Chicago who attended this afternoon in the Teach Meet and is going to talk a little bit about what it was like and how that compared to Ed Camp. It's my first Teach Meet. Uh, and the uh, setup was similar to Ed Camp, but a little bit different in that here at ISTE we didn't have choice in terms of where we went room to room. Um, it was nice to have the breakout time options of two minutes, seven minutes, or 20. And we, I understand you can tweak those as needed. That's certainly a difference from Ed Camp where you have usually a 45 minute or an hour long block to go. Um, fewer sponsors with this one, but I understand that that might also be something that you would have in, in a, a regular teach meet. Certainly, I think more similarities than differences. And uh, so it was really interesting to hear. Uh, not a lot of platform or, or brand conversation, much more skills-based and um, th things along that line. For your so, own learning style, how, how do you think this compares to the EdCamp experience? I'm an EdCamp junkie. I'm actually an EdCamp organizer. Um, I, I think this is great, and I think if you were going to do within district, um, two, seven, or 20 minute, or what, however you want to break up time-wise, gives people that opportunity to, you know, maybe you don't want to cook a full Thanksgiving dinner, but you can bring snacks, that sort of thing. You, you, can, you can bring whatever you wanted to bring um, to things. It's certainly a great way to, to practice or inspire younger teachers, or maybe a little more tech-hesitant teachers to uh, get up and share some of their own stuff as well. So I think that's, that's really maybe an interesting way to uh, look at like a half-day PD within your own district. All right, awesome.